<laughs> I was hanging with you and then I realized I didn't think it was true. I was surprised when I found out I'd fallen for you. I've discovered that when you're filming on knife, when you have to look right here in the lens. Welcome back. I know this may be extremely strange considering I haven't uploaded a YouTube video in a year now. Um, but yeah, um, I've decided that I'm coming back to YouTube. Um, the year for me, well, from the time I uploaded my last video until now, it's been absolutely insane. It was, it's been amazing. It's had a lot of challenges and stuff like that. I'm thinking about making a separate video, going into depth and kind of catching up with you guys on that. I could take a 46 year break and still come back to YouTube. If I was ever stopping it, I would make a video updating. School work, I had a ton of that, kind of just got in the way of things, etc, etc. Um, and a bunch of other complications, not necessarily bad ones. That quick explanation, I'm back, I'm sorry. Surprise, bitch. I bet you thought you'd seen the last of me. So besides that, um, of course it is a very scary time in the world right now with the virus. It's absolutely uh, terrifying and considering we're all meant to be in quarantine right now, school's been shut, um, I've been in the house, I find this time where I could sit down and I could do the things that I've always wanted to do. Well, not the things I've always wanted to do, but the things that I needed to get done because I always make a list, so I'm very organized. I have been very anxious and bored in the house as well as I'm sure you guys are. So I decided, you know what? This could be a really good time where I can sit down and do the stuff that I want to get done, but just haven't bothered to do. And I was like, well, YouTube is the number one topic. And I was like, well, how am I going to do YouTube if I'm stuck in the house? what am I going to do? And I was like, you know what, I could just do a little vlog on how I'm getting through all this and how I'm, strategies I'm using to keep myself occupied and just generally a vlog update. Hi, I know it is a bit of a strange way to welcome myself back, but um, yeah, it is a very, very scary time in the world and my heart goes out to all you guys and um, your families. Please stay safe. I was actually meant to be going to New York, New York, Next month, of course, you guys already knew that I was a there a couple of years ago and my New York video was supposed to be my welcome back video. I was really, really excited for it. It is heartbreaking that I'm not going to New York. I will be going when the flights come ba back on and whatever, because we're getting our money refunded, which is amazing. But even though it is heartbreaking, it's still zero importance because the well-being of everybody is the most important. Welcome, welcome back. back. I, I hope you're excited, excited to see me back. back. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. Good morning, everybody. It is... 9 o'clock, I've woken up, it's like, I don't know what day it is of isolation, but I'm just eating my breakfast here and watching Our Planet with Diva Amber. So, I'm starting the morning off with a smoothie, I'm trying to get into the swing of being a bit more healthy, um, I've been focusing on a lot of things like that during the quarantine, so when the quarantine's over, I can continue life with these good habits, so yeah. So this is just raspberry and strawberry, it's really good. Gain all the door handles. <laughs> that was my parcel right now but it's not we need to prevent every single germ because it is just to be cautious you know you all know why um i'm gonna actually clean my mirror because it is so it's got these wee things on it i actually used to do this in my job i got fired <laughs> She just made a TikTok. Yeah, I know, I'm so cringe. I'm just trying, just trying. I can now know my name. But yeah, I've got like 100 followers on TikTok, so I don't know if that's good or not, but yeah. Um, gonna do some school work, then go on a little self isolation walk, and then reorganize my room. It's tidy enough, but I'm a perfectionist, so. It's all beat and all talk. She tells you a story and makes you want to dance. Steve Fox examines an overnight phenomenon, rapping to the beat. I'm not ready 
put some Suda cream on my face because my skin has been very bad during this quarantine. We're in quarantine, we don't have to look good, it's okay. So, just got this on, but at least it covers my spots. I would prefer having like this instead of having big red spots, do you know what I mean? So yeah. <laughs> for me not as depressing as um most of the quarantine days have been um so yeah please comment down below some things that you are doing to keep yourselves occupied and busy um so besides that on a funny note <laughs> i i don't know what i'm gonna do this isn't important at all but it's just I'm, I'm not even i don't even care about it it doesn't affect me because it's the tiniest tiniest little problem but it's funny to think about what my hair will look like in a couple months I don't know how long we're going to be quarantined for, um, but obviously my hair grows very fast and um, it doesn't really matter. So <laughs> yeah, my hair is actually going to look overgrown. I might have to cut it myself. My cousin actually did shave his head, so maybe I'll take his advice. <laughs> going to make some tea now, so yeah. So this might be like the plan of the yips. Just eating Chinese food now. Noodles are the best. And I'm going to watch more Disney Plus and um, my good friend Keila has given it to me and I am so f***ing grateful. This was my favourite TV show when I was younger. Jesse. Steve Fox examines an overnight phenomenon. Rapping to the beat. really 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 bad during this whole quarantine thing i really don't know maybe it's just breaked up broken out well clearly but i don't know why but yeah um and i had chinese food that's probably not gonna help uh with the uh, breakouts but like my acne i don't necessarily have acne but i have really bad like like sp spotty like blackhead skin and it's just like my forehead is so clear like literally my forehead is clear and like my hair covers it but these bits aren't clear and my hair doesn't cover like obviously like why is the place that's covered by her the clearest but the bit that everyone can see isn't like it's really oh so annoying uh by the way i don't know where that music is coming from um yeah so see if the, like this see if like someone just like scanned this whole area in my face and like cleared it like that and here skin would be perfect Okay, so the quality is definitely dropped. I really don't know. I've never used the webcam on this uh, laptop before. I still have my face mask on. I'm going to go wash it off. But yeah, I just wanted to say um, this is the end of the day. I want to say, say thank you so much for watching this video. Stay safe, guys. I love you all. And I hope you're excited for more videos.